I want to talk about vegetarianism and my encounter with it and my failure or success. Um, I haven't had red meat mammals since 1995. When I was a kid, man, I was a metasaurus. I was a carnivore, a pinoranosaur. I, I was the cook in our household on the barbecue, and I made the greatest pepper steak. You take, a, like, you know, sirloin, T-bone, porterhouse, filet mignon. You take that baby, you take full uh, uh, whole peppercorns, hammer them in, like with an abalone hammer. Trains are coming right now on both sides. So you've got it encrusted with these peppers. Throw it on the barbecue, cook it to, you know, medium rare really is my favorite. And then take it off, scrape off the peppercorns and serve it. You've got pepper steak like you wouldn't believe. I so miss bacon, especially when I'm eating pancakes or nice sausage, good old Farmer John sausage, yeah. Um, prime rib, mmm, with horseradish sauce. Um, geez, you know, uh, oh. French dip with a jus. But I gave it all up in 1995 after I saw Babe. Now don't laugh, but it really hurt me. It really hit me that I was eating an intelligent creature. And I think how I feel about it is, is you have a choice to make how far up the evolutionary scale you are going to feed. Would you eat a primate? Would you eat a chimp? Would you eat a human if you had to? I decided I'm not going to eat mammals anymore. To eat a mammal to me is just too close to home. And as I've come to know mammals and understand them, uh, they are capable of fear and love and hope and despair just like we are. I can't do that anymore. So I tried going total vegan for a while, total vegetarian, but um, I love milk, man. Give me 2% milk, I could just guzzle that till I'll be dead. I, I love milk. Um, I can't understand people who won't even eat honey because it comes out of a bee's ass. I don't know, it's not seems to, doesn't seem in any way to me to hurt the bee to take their honey. Um, I love cheese. Give me con queso with just about everything. And um, I'll eat chicken. I'll eat fish because if I had to, yes, I would kill it with my own hands in order to eat it, but I'd prefer not to. I've had chickens for pets and they're really quite nice animals, but I still eat chicken because I have to have some form of protein. And as I found with trying to live without it, I just can't live without it. So I'm doing my best. Maybe at some point I can cut out all meat, but I'm still going to eat cheese and milk and honey and things that I consider harmless. Eggs, you know, that doesn't bother me. It's not killing anything to do that. And uh, I think I, I feel okay about where I am right now. And that's why I am a semi-vegetarian.